Good morning, lovely people. Alrighty, welcome to the madhouse. School holidays still, kids are running wild. I'm gonna make it even worse by giving them triple chocolate pancakes. <laughs> oh, I love school holidays. All right, well, let's get stuck into this. Better late than never, eh? So first of all, I'll put the recipe below as always. We need two cups of self-raising flour and two tablespoons of cocoa powder, sifted together. Then we'll put a third of a cup of caster sugar in and just mix them through. Set that aside. The next thing we need to do is we need to melt down 50 grams of butter in a small saucepan on really low heat. Next we need 600 ml of milk in a jug. We want to get two eggs and whisk them up. Add them to your milk mix and whisk it. While you're whisking it, add your melted butter. Sorry, in your way. Get your flour mix. In goes your milk mix. Mix it up. Alright, once you've whisked it really well and there's no lumps left in it, we want to wrap it. Some glad wrap over the top. And we want to set it aside for half an hour. All right, so while we're waiting for the pancake mix, we're going to make our homemade chocolate custard. So first thing we need is a medium bowl. You've got to put your caster sugar and your corn flour in there and mix that up good first. Then we want to get two egg yolks and mix them in really well. So whisk it until it looks like this. Mm. And we put that aside for a minute. Next we get a saucepan, we put three quarters of a cup of milk in and half a cup of cream. We want to put it on the stove top and bring it to the boil. So as soon as it starts to boil, it comes straight off. And now I've just pulled it off as it goes to boil. Alright, so we get our uh, egg and caster sugar mix and we slowly pour in the hot milk and cream mix. A little bit at a time. Right now it's all blended in beautifully. We put it back into the saucepan. We add 100 grams of dark chocolate melts. Now we want to put it back on the stove um, in between low and medium and we want to keep whisking it until it goes thick like custard. So you start with the low to medium heat. Um, after a couple of minutes, start slowly turning it up and slowly turning it up until you get it to go thick like custard. I'll show you with the spoon just so you can see. Oh, look at that, that's exactly how you want it, folks. All right, so now what we do is we set that aside and give it a quick whisk once every five minutes or so to stop a thick skin forming on the top. Now the next thing we want to do is we want to get a garnish ready for on top of the custard. Oh no, it's crazy isn't it? <laughs> Alright, so um, normally I would uh, just grate some chocolate on top, but I've got these Toblerones left over, so if you've got any favourite chocolate bars left over, um, use them. So I've got these, so what I want to do is chop them up. Toblerones are amazing, they're chocolate with little bits of nougat in them. But yeah, any chocolate, otherwise great plain chocolate if you haven't got any chocolates. So there's dark chocolate, milk chocolate and white chocolate ones here. I thought, oh, that's pretty fancy. So I'm going to chop them all up on a plate. So when we're ready to do our pancakes and put our chocolate custard on and we sprinkle that over the top. Now we're ready to cook. Alright, so you get your pancake mix and you don't stir it, alright. You get yourself a quarter measuring cup and we're going to use that to pour our pancakes in, the mix in. Now, um, put it on a medium heat. I'm going to spray it with a little bit of olive oil spray. If you don't have any, um, use a little bit of butter. So I'm going to do three at a time.
They'll only take a minute on the other side and then we serve them. First pancake on. Oh yeah. Now if you're a real chocolate connoisseur, <laughs> I would be putting a little bit of Nutella on that now. But I'm not ODing the kids today. All right, a little bit of Nutella if you really like lots and lots of chocolate. Then your second pancake on. Third pancake on. Pour our beautiful homemade chocolate custard. Oh, come on now. Oh my gosh. This makes up heaps of pancakes too, heaps. And a little bit of our chocolate. Thank you guys so much for watching. Have yourselves an awesome day. I'll be back. Bye.